Welcome to our fundraising campaign, Hope for Erin. My name is Dr. Rod Pazeski. I'm a spiritual life coach and a healer. I have an honor to have met with Erin, my friend, who has gone through tremendous challenges within the past few months of his life and has had a major accident which has left him being quadriplegic. I am Erin's younger sister and his favorite sister and his only sister. Erin was someone who was a lyricist and loved music from the time that he was a teenager. Um, he, he made music, he published music and it is something that he was very talented at and had a passion about. On uh, January 9th of this year, uh, Aaron happened to be in Phoenix at the time and was crossing the street and unfortunately was hit by a van that fled the scene. So this was a hit and run accident. And every time the doctors would come in, they would tell us, we don't know if he's going to make it, he probably won't make it. If he makes it, he will never breathe again on his own. He will never talk. He will never move. It's going to be a question. He has made progress and just to get to this point has been miraculous. The second I saw you and I heard about this, this thing, I said, he needs assistance and he needs more care, he needs more therapy, more rehab facility, more people to come at home and uh, I see the potential. What is it that we absolutely need immediately for his care? So Aaron, as uh, the baseline that he is now, is someone that requires total care. Yeah. What is total care? It's 24-7 care for Aaron. Unfortunately, he's not able to do anything uh, independently for himself physically. So, total care is someone that can help lift Aaron, um, put him in, in and out of the wheelchair, be able to um, shower him, be able to change him, be able to feed him, be able to scratch his eye if he needs to, right. scratch his head, dress him, everything that we take for granted that we do every day. They think we, we, right now. we need another human being to do this activity yes. of daily yes. from A to Z. Eric, I want you to tell the people you're connecting with your heart, which is you have a beautiful heart, what's your intention? And we set the intention. My back. intention is to be healthy, to live out my life's dream, and to I forgot the purpose. My Leave purpose. the purpose. Yeah, my purpose in my life. Yes. To heal, to have good health, and to what is the second one? Help others. Help others. Help others. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. And I want to thank you for really bringing so much um, light and positivity and genuine passion for helping Aaron and our family and for really inspiring our family to do this because as an outsider I think Dr. Rod was looking down to see what's going to come up for Aaron what's coming up because honestly when we're in this bubble it's day to day, day to day, how do we ever get through the next day, the next day. so I appreciate that so much and um, so much gratitude that this has even brought me closer to my brother. Here's my invitation to you. Here's my challenge to you. You know what the purpose of living is? The purpose of living is giving. And what better opportunity do you have during the high holidays that's coming up? And for other people, every day is a new day of challenge. And every day is a new day to open your heart and, and tap into your soul for, for new happenings for your life. So, I challenge you to this. I guarantee you, when you go to our link, when you go for for giving a, for this cause to Aaron, the, the, the universe is gonna multiply your generosity tenfolds, hundredfolds, one thousandfold. 
the universe is going to bring so much love and abundance and, 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 and peace of mind and healing and well-being in your life. I will guarantee you because I believe in the universal law of karma and giving. And I know the reason Aaron is here, he's going to be the perfect condition to help thousands and thousands of other people who are going to be in the same position as he is. And he's going to be the voice of inspiration for their total healing. And I know, I know that I've seen the vision. And this right here, what we've created, came directly from the Spirit of God, the vision of what is holding for us. So, thank you guys, love you guys, and uh, please go ahead and donate for our cause. Live, reason to live. Nobody got a reason to give, reason to give. Everybody got a reason to live, reason to live. Nobody got a reason to give, reason to give. All of us waiting for a miracle. I know this girl always getting all hysterical. Never looking at the bright spots, so typical. Hurry up, I need a love transfusion. Something like a blow to the head, no confusion. Give it to me straight, don't bother wasting your breath. Just getting started, got a whole lot left. Everybody left the building, got them scared to death. You know how I feel, thank God they left. No business being here, I'm the last one left. Gotta go, we can go home. Unless homeless, less, lesser than you don't have a home. Everybody got a reason to 